Well, children are bearing the brunt of the ongoing violence in Afghanistan. A new UN report shows that the death toll among Afghan civilians, especially children, has increased dramatically due to widespread violence in the country. Our correspondent Amin Alami brings us a story from Kabul. The United Nations is concerned about the rise of child casualties in Afghanistan. A new UN report shows that at least 2,502 children have lost their lives in 2014, while 5,047 more suffered injuries. Afghanistan's Independent Human Rights Commission has also confirmed this report. Although the government has done its best to protect the lives of children so far, unfortunately the country has witnessed an increase in death toll of children due to violence and war in Afghanistan. Authorities here believe that the main cause for soaring child casualties in Afghanistan is, of course, lack of implementation of law as well as inattention of warring groups, especially the Taliban and its associates, to the lives of people. There is, of course, a standoff in this regard, that is, lack of implementation of our specific laws to reduce children's casualties. If we really respect the law, then the situation will get better. In its latest report, the UN has asked the Afghan government to make efforts to prevent joining of children to military firms, the Taliban and other terrorist groups in Afghanistan. This is not only the Taliban attacks or explosions which easily claim the lives of scores of Afghan children, but poverty and unemployment are also considered as other causes. To feed their families, thousands of Afghan children have to work and for many of them, joining to some military firms and even to the Taliban is considered as a shorter way to earn money. However, the ongoing violence doesn't allow them to reach to their sweet dreams. Amin Alami, Press TV, Kabul.